वेलकम टू इट्स टुमारो न्यूज आई एम दिपाशा शर्मा डेथ एंड डिस्प्लेसमेंट एज फ्लड्स हिस्ट ईस्ट अफ्रीका फ्लडिंग थ्रू आउट ईस्टर्न अफ्रीका हैज किल डजन ऑफ पीपल एंड डिस्प्ले टेन ऑफ थाउजेंड्स अंडर स्कोरिंग इंटेंसिफाइंग क्लाइमेट रिस्क इन द ड्रॉट स्टिक इन रीजन एड एजेंसी इज रिपोर्टेड ऑन मंडे अकॉर्डिंग टू द कैनिया रेड क्रॉस सोसाइटी torrential rain swept the usually dry country sending water tearing through entire villages and washing through the streets the disaster forced 4000 families to evacuate from their homes local media reported the kenya red cross society which provides humanitarian relief in the country also noted that 1000 livestock animals were killed and at least 97 hectares of agriculture farmland were destroyed by the downpour Flooding has continued to affect neighboring East African states as well with dozens dying in Ethiopia and Somalia. According to Ethiopia's regional government, more than 20 people have died and over 12,000 others have been forced out of their homes in Somali region due to the flash flooding this rainy season. In Somalia, heavy flooding during this season which runs from October to December has displaced more than 113,000 people and temporarily affected hundreds of thousand the un office for the coordination of humanitarian affairs reported the southwest and jubaland states are the worst hit with a total of about 536608 people affected ocha said earlier this year floods forced 250000 people out of their homes after the shabil river in the central somalia broke its bank and submerged the town of beledwin OCHA said last month that Eastern Africa would likely encounter heavier than normal rains over the October December period because of the El Nino phenomenon. El Nino is a weather pattern associated with increased heat worldwide as well as drought in some parts of the world and heavy rains elsewhere. The Horn of Africa is one of the worst vulnerable regions to climate change with extreme weather events growing increasing common and intense. Since late 2020 Somalia as well as parts of Ethiopia and Kenya have been suffering the region's worst drought in 40 years. At the end of 2019 at least 265 people died and tens of thousands were displaced during two months of relentless rainfall in several countries in East Africa. The extreme weather affected close to 2 million people and washed away tens of thousands of livestock animals in Burundi, Djibouti, Ethiopia, Kenya, Somalia, South Sudan, Tanzania and Uganda. Climate change is making floods more frequent and severe, the Kenya Red Cross Society said after the latest flash flooding. There is an urgent need to invest in climate adaptation measures to protect communities from the devastating impacts of floods and other adverse weather conditions. That's all for now. For more updates, stay tuned with us on its tomorrow news. For more global weather updates like this, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates.